Hi, I'm Phoebe, here to give you a top tip from the Target Validation team. When it comes to accounting for emissions in Category 15, the main thing that your company should keep in mind is that emissions from investments are not only applicable to financial institutions. Companies that choose an operational or financial control consolidation approach to calculate their GHG inventory should account for emissions here from any joint ventures, subsidiaries or financing activities that your company has financial stake in but does not wholly own or control. These entities scope 1 and 2 emissions should be reported in your scope 3 category 15 proportionate to your company's equity share. For example, if your company has a joint venture with a third party in which it has 10% ownership but does not have operational control over, 10% of the scope 1 and 2 emissions generated by said joint venture should be reported here. This is crucial because although the emissions in this category might be low at the point of your submission, we often see that these emission sources can develop over time into more established businesses with a higher environmental impact. Thanks for watching and we look forward to receiving your submission.